Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're going to be doing a ball mastery workout. So grab a football in a small area. Oh, remember to subscribe. We're trying to get to 100 before the end of the month. So let's go. Okay, so the first exercise we are going to do is the triangle. But this time we are going to use the outside of our foot to push the ball outwards. Okay, so it's pull back, push it out with the outside of your foot and then you push it forward using the inside of your foot okay we're going to do this for one minute all out remember do it at your pace if you can do it faster than me great if you need to go a bit slower then by all means do so keep the ball under control pushing it out the triangle let's go three two one off we go and time okay we are going to move on to the reverse L drag this time you need to pull the ball back around the outside of your standing leg and then collect the ball using the foot that you pulled it with we are going to do this for 30 seconds on each foot so let's get ready to go let's go Okay, let's switch over now. And time. Okay, this time we are going to do the unlimited CR7 chop, okay? And like before, you have to use the inside of your heel to chop the ball behind your standing leg, all right? Start slow, get your rhythm, and as you gain more control of the ball, speed it up. See how fast you can go, test yourself out. Let's get ready to go. Let's go. Great effort. And time. Next, 
we are going to do the side sweep drag back. To do this, you need to push the ball using the inside of your foot and you remain in touch with the ball across your body. So it's one motion across your body and then you drag it back using the sole of your foot back to the starting position. Okay, so remember guys, it's one motion. You sweep the ball across your body using the inside of your foot. When you get to the destination, you drag it back using the sole of your foot. We're going to do this for one minute. 30 seconds on each foot, so let's get ready to go. Let's go! Weak foot time, let's go. and time okay the next one is quite similar to the inside shuffle however instead of repeatedly going side to side we are going to do it inside then a slight stop okay so you're cushioning the ball stopping it on the other foot and then you'll do the same in reverse okay we're going to do this for one minute flat out so remember guys it's from one side to the other you stop it and then do that again in reverse. Let's get ready to go. And off we go. Time. Great work. Okay, now to the outside inside on the single leg. Okay, so just as we've done beforehand, where we've done outside inside using both feet, now we're just going to do it with one leg for 30 seconds and then change over. Okay, so just keeping the ball. In a, in a small space, in a small area, we're not trying to kick the ball too wide on either side, alright? So outside, inside, keep the ball closed, keep the ball under control, and then we'll switch when I say switch. So let's get ready to go. Off we go! And let's switch feet now.
and time. Okay, to finish off, we are going to do the under rolls. And here, we pull the ball using the sole of our feet, okay? And then with the same foot, we do a step over motion, okay? So you do an outward step over. Pull the ball and do an outward step over with the same foot. We're going to do four in a row or two in a row, depending on your space. And then we'll change and go a different direction. So we're walking up and down in the little area that we've got, okay? So let's get ready to go. Last time, last minute. Three, two, one, let's go. time fantastic work today guys well done thanks for watching the video remember to like comment share and most importantly subscribe 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 till next time see you later